Hello, in this video we will discuss about the acetic acid bacteria. It is also known as the acetobacter. So what is the function of acetobacter? In this video we will understanding about the mechanism of the production of the apple cider vinegar. So how to produce vinegar? So it is gram negative bacteria and oxidized sugar or ethanol. Uh, sugar or ethanol into the acetic acid so the produce a uh, acetic acid uh, CH3COH from the CH3CH2OH is the ethanol and on the other hand here is the during fermentation basically it produce the acetic acid and fermentation is the obligate aerob aerobic so it means the obligate aerobes bacteria acetobacter so this is the alcohol which that's contain formula chemical CH3CH2OH and in this way here is the bacterial fermentation due to the uh, due to the uh, when we will expose into the air so the apple cider vinegar will be formed this is, is known as the CH3COH and this is the oxidizing due to the oxygen presence for the bacteria because uh, it, Bacteria use oxygen is important for this mechanism. So we will discuss whole mechanism and how the oxygen will use and other things. So the molecular pathway, uh, cellular pathway we will discuss. And when open in air, alcohol or sugar convert into acetic acid. So their prevention of alcohol is important by closed anaerobic condition and that is why we will remove the air which that are present in the alcohol because alcohol will not uh, uh, alcohol will not their property will maintain if we will open the bottle but remember we can add the acetobacter with our requirement in the industrial uh, industrial food product as well as other things for example the vinegar production so this is the electron microscope because it is the microbes acetobacter which that is showing in this diagram is look like this and this is the rod shape bacteria anyhow here is i am drawing the acetobacter which that is also contain flagella so this 24 genera which that's contain uh, this acetobacter family so this is the CH3CH2OH when alcohol will be contact with the bacteria so the when we will add when apple so the apple cider vinegar will be formed while on the other hand we can also prepare through sugar when add with the uh, apple so it can also convert due to the sugar usage so remember that things but in this case we will understand through uh, alcohol ethanol so the use of fat loss is very important from this vinegar so is acetic acid metabolism regulation and acid base balance also used for it and improved digestive system that is important we will discuss in the next video about the uh, vinegar mood of action in our body physiology and changes of our body physiology of the, due to the acetic acid we will discuss in the next video with explanation but in this case, we will understand about the acetobacter conversion of the acetic acid from the ethanol. So this is the plasma membrane, which that is contain extracellular of the bacteria, as well as this is the intracellular, uh, uh, intracellular bacterial uh, part. So what that means? This is the nucleus, which that is contain DNA. So remember. And DNA is important for the production of enzyme, protein, for the changes of the uh, uh, alcohol into the acetic acid. So this is the alcohol. It can be moved directly into the alcohol. While, on the other hand, the extracellular reaction will be occurred. This is the P double Q A D H. This P double Q A L D H is the py pyrol pyrolo line quinone dependent uh, acetaldehyde dehydrogenase because it depend um, uh, the acetaldehyde dehydrogenase to the PQQ so that is why this is the protein are present in the extracellular region but it will contact with the plasma membrane of the bacteria 
and it convert the acetaldehyde from this and this is the p double q aldh again which that will convert the acetic acid with the mcd aldh mcd means the molybdenum molybd molybdopterin cytosine uh, dinucleotide dependent acetaldehyde dehydrogenase so it depend the mcd so remember and it depend to the mcd for the conversion of the acetaldehyde into the acetic acid anyhow so this is electron will be oxidized and produce the electron and this electron will receive through ubiquinone ubiquinone will convert into the ubiquinone and in this way the conversion with the addition of the proton for exception ex accepting of the electron and here is the NADH dehydrogenase enzyme also present. And when alcohol moves inside, so the NAD uh, 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 dehydrogenase enzyme is used to don carry the electron and it can convert into the NADH from the NAD. And this electron accepts by our NADP, NADH dehydrogenase. Uh, to give the ubiquinone to ubiquinol formation. So this is the acetaldehyde formation which that give the electron to the NAD aldehyde dehydrogenase and NADP uh, aldehyde dehydrogenase to conversion the NAD plus to the NADH. So remember uh, and acetic acid formation by this mechanism. Uh, this is the biochemistry of the acetic acid production and it can be moved out through the acetic acid transporter protein channel and move out and we can say that it is the acetic acid formation. So this is the alcohol for example which that will also trigger the transcription factor the protein and acetic acid also trigger this transcription factor after the triggering to phosphorylation of this transcription factor will bind with the DNA to translate uh, after the transcription so the transcription to the translation and translation of protein what that protein enzyme synthesis for more acetic acid conversion so that is all thing and in this way the enzyme which that required for the conversion of alcohol into the acetic acid as shown in the figure we can understand uh, that is the translational protein so this is the enzyme synthesis uh, for more acetic acid conversion for example the pqq adh and pqq aldh mcd aldh basically and on the other hand the nad hd hydrogenase enzyme basically all is made up of protein while on the other hand the, this is the mechanism for the conversion so this is acetic acid also important for the move into the uh, by the conversion with the acetyl coa synthase enzyme used to produce the acetyl coa this acetyl coa is two carbon containing compound when enter into the tricarboxylic acid cycle when enter into the tricarboxylic acid cycle, it will produce the carbon dioxide and on the other hand the ATP as well as the NADPH, NADH and FADH2. So remember the NADPH and NADH, FADH2 is the higher proton donor and which that will donate the proton on the basis of requirement and it is important for the electron transport chain to produce more ATP. So it will produce more ATP due to the NADPH and NADH and FADH2 for the electron transport chain to produce the ATP. So remember, this NADPH will give the proton and this proton uh, will basically uh, move out through the ubiquinone oxidase enzyme. So in the bacteria, the ubiquinone oxidase enzyme use uh, rather than the electron transport chain. And in this way, the, uh, here is you can see, this is the movement of the proton outflux due to the ubiquinone oxidase enzyme, ubiquinone oxidase. So after this moving out this proton, 
so the water will be used to produce oxygen uh, so, uh, so th this is the mechanism basically is the water will produce from the oxygen not this is the a uh, incorrect you can correct it so the oxygen will use to produce the water on the other hand that is why the oxygen is very important for the acetobacter on the other hand here is the electron will be donate from the nadh so remember nadh will donate the electron while the proton will pump out when pump out the proton it means the uh, the concentration of the proton will be more in the outside it means the proton will move in through a atp synthase enzyme when the four proton move in that energy will store in the form of atp from the adp by the binding of the phosphate inorganic phosphate group anyhow this is the mechanism of the acetic acid production so this is the acetic acid will be formed and that acetic acid is a vinegar which that we can use as a apple cider vinegar if we will add the apple and sugar because it is also produced from sugar or alcohol so basically we are understanding in this video only sugar but only alcohol but sugar also involved 